Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, I'm Sanky84 and welcome to Patrick's Parabox, a lovely little puzzle game that very quickly gets quite trippy and we'll get into why and how in a minute. But yep, this is your typical puzzle game with a slight twist. Because the puzzles are on different levels and you need to switch between levels to solve the problems that come up. And, well, you'll see. It very quickly gets quite trippy trying to solve some of these puzzles. Now, just to make you aware, this is the demo that I have downloaded. I thought I had been downloading the full game. But I didn't realise that I'd only got the demo version of it, so whoops for that. But I thought, you know what, let's show this off for now and we'll deal with getting the full version another time. But I will put a link in the description down to the full version, as always, in case you're interested in giving this a go yourself. But without further ado, let's get in and see what Patrick's Parabox has to offer, shall we? So, straight away, yes, it gives you an idea of what it's all going to be for. So, yes, this lovely pink square here is Patrick, and we need to solve his Parabox. So, at the minute, you can see, to get onto the next area, we need to complete nine puzzles. And, at the minute, we've only got the one available, so, in we go. And, literally... In we go. So, very simple. Move the square into the area and get on ours. There we go. Next one. Okay, so now we've got two. So, move them into the correct area. Very simple, very straightforward. And now we have a little bit of a issue with this one. Because, yeah, how are we going to get you out? So, push it down. Round we go, and in. Not hard, but as I say, there we go. So there's the first bit, just to get you used to the controls, and just in case, you know, you weren't too sure on how these work. But then, things start getting a little bit different. So, in we go, and now you'll see we've got a slightly different looking one. So, we move that up. Oh no! We are blocked. What can we do? Well, let's just push these over and... Oh, it goes in. Okay. Oh, look. We can go in as well. And, yeah, there we go. Nice and simple, that one. But you get the idea. You need to put boxes inside boxes to get them in the right places. Or you need to use them to pass through yourself. Just like that one. And again, just to make sure that we've got the idea, let's just move use all the way around there, because, yeah, going to be full viewing of it. So there we go. Okay, this one's a little bit more tricky. So all you need to do is move you down like that, you up there. Push you out the way. Round. And there we go. Nice and easy. And again, now we're going a little bit more because, yeah, the location for this one is actually inside there. So we'll push you into that again. Wrong at the beginning, so not too complicated. And there, again, we now need to be careful because, yeah, where we need to get to is inside. So, if I was to put that there, well, we can't get inside. So, in you go. Round. Push you back out. Thank you very much. And there we go. That's the first level done. Gives you a basic idea. And, yep, just check. All done. Thank you. Now it's time to move on to, well, something a little bit more complicated. And this one gives you some options you can do if you wish. 
So let's uh, move on in. And now again, we've got a little bit of a situation here. So just push you down in, use that to move it down, bring it round. Oh, thank you very much. As I say, these ones are pretty straightforward. So yeah, what we'll need to do now with this one is push you down to there. Thank you. And then you can join it. Don't want to do it up top, otherwise we're going to be in a bit of a sticky situation. So there we go. So yeah, you've got to use what you've got to try and get things. Now this one's pretty straightforward because it's just make sure you don't put it on the wrong one that I've gone and done. Because now if I was to do that, yeah, I can't get in. And that won't be active because that was not covered. So, nice and simple. I mean, it's very easy. So, put you there, you there, down. Thank you. I mean, so, you know, it's very easy to get things muddled up. And, yeah, this one is quite a fun one. So, I need to now block both of them up. And get inside that one. So just push you onto there. That covers you. You up. Onto there. And down we go right the way in to get you. And thank you so much. Now I can skip this one. There is no need for me to actually do it. But we're still going to do it. So let's head in. And again, this one looks pretty easy, but as we know, it's not going to be. So, push it down. Oh, look. If I just take you round there, push you out. Hmm, we've got a situation again. So, that's not going to work. So, we know we're going to keep you there. Push you back out and out. So that's fine there. You down, you up. Thank you. And again, I can skip this one now because these are now unlocked. But I don't want to. We're doing them all. So in we go. And this one, yeah. Okay, we don't have anything around. So, okay. We'll go into there and into there and then we'll push you down to there and then we'll go even further in and there we go that's the one we want so let's get you out and just push you all the way back out thank you very much yeah these puzzles can get quite in and now we get on to the ones that become even more trippy because you're not only controlling one Patrick, you're, well, you're actually controlling an unlimited amount. So if I was to, say, move here, ah, look, nice big giant Patrick there. So move this along, and as you can see, all around us, it's moving, and even the Patrick in the box is doing what we say. So move along, down, and... There we go, Patrick comes out there, and another one appears inside, so just push you up. Um, and it doesn't matter which way we go, we just go around there, out, push you into there, and there we go. So yeah, it's not just a case of trying to control one Patrick. It's a case of controlling multiple, and as you are about to see, yeah, it's not as easy as you may think. So we just go around, push you down, and on. So yeah, you've got to think in multiple ways, and again, pretty simple this one. But again, now moving blocks from one layer to another. Thank you. Back we come. And okay, this one. So push it down. You go there. Thank 
you push it down and out we go right okay so we can't get out of here but we can't we do need to get you to move down so let's push you up to there because we've got a nice area round out and down we go and now we've got the issue of yeah there we go push you over there took me a minute then to think about it there we go round so yeah, it's not just a case of, oh look, push it round and there is a little bit of fun. But yeah, you've got to think in multiple dimensions. So let's just finish these last two off. Technically, I can probably just do these two and it will unlock it. But we're going to clear the whole lot out. So let's get you and okay, so it's down there and down there so that's not going to work because we can't push it down but what we can do is push it to there oh, one more nope that's too many but it's okay we'll go around push you down to there is that going to work i don't think that's going to work actually no because that's trapped now that is trapped so okay let's try that one again can't move you you're stuck there. And you are stuck there. Oh, of course, yeah. It push you along there. Come round. That's it. Push. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. How am I going to now get... Yes, that's it. You in there. Push it down, because that's what this area is for. Push you up. Round. Thank you. There we go. Took me a minute to figure that one out. But thank you. And let's just get you done while we're here. Okay. Oh, this one can be interesting because... Yeah. If I push you there and then try pushing you out... We've kind of created a bit of a paradox now. Yeah, we've got an infinite one that we can do nothing with, and this one's now blocked off, so... Yeah, we've kind of, uh, blocked ourselves out of this. What's well, quite amusing, I do like that. The fact that, if you do that, you can paradox yourself into infinity. So, okay, let's reset that back. Right, so, push you to there, because that's obviously where it needs to go. Out... Push you down to there. Push you out the top of that one. And there we go. Lovely. So there we go. That is there. And that is now letting us go on to level three. But as I say, as this is the demo, yeah, that's the end of the game there. So we're not going to do that yet. We're going to carry on with these last few. Let's have a look. Okay, so that's only got one inside it. But to get in there, I'm going to have to push that up. And if I push it up, we're not going to be able to do it. So just move used to there. Again, it's all about just thinking about how it is. And okay, again, we've got ourselves a situation here where we need to get in to move that one. But I need that down here. So we'll move you over to there. As I say, this one is a little bit quicker for me. Because I've already figured these out. Not realising it was the demo I was playing. But, as I say, some of these took me forever to figure out. There we go. That someone's done. So quickly, let's get you done and... Yeah, again, this is a pretty, oops, simple one. Moved a bit too fast then. Ah, I've done it again. Yeah, I've gone and got myself trapped. So, yeah, if you don't concentrate, that can happen. So, what I need to do is push you down to there. You around. Put you in the top. And then push you 
up there. So yeah, it's not always just as simple as it seems. Easy to get yourself trapped in a paradox. Right, next again. We are going to need you down there because what well, we do. And then that's wrong, isn't it? That is not in the right spot, or is it? No, it is, because that one goes there then. I push that down there so I can go through. And then move you up. There we go. That's it. Okay, and again, another one that requires making sure things get put in the correct spot. So, yeah, you can still move and get in without issue. Because, yeah, if I was to say, oh, well, that's good, now I can go in, no. Because that will push him. So, just make sure none of them can move. Thank you very much. There we go. That's all them done. Actually done. We've got three more left to do. So, let's quickly have a look. Okay, we've got... Oh, what was this one now? This one was an absolute pain. So, yeah, I need to move you up, you round to there, pop out, no, no, wait a minute, wait a minute, that's wrong, that's wrong, what I needed to do was, you up there, you there, up you to there, that's it, and you swap them around, there we go, you go there, there we go, that was it, nearly got me again that one did, okay, and you are, yeah, so let's move you up to there, you think, oops, you think it would just push you along there, but then you trap that one. So, nope. Push you to there, because I don't want you going too far. You into there, because as I say, you've got to think in multiple dimensions here. And I've pushed it too far over. Okay. That's fine. I wanted to push it the one, not the two. So, just quickly. There we go. You there, thank you. There we go. Okay, and this one is an, another one that is very easy to paradox yourself out of. So, first, pretty simple one, you know. Push you down to there. You along to there. Then push you down. Do the same at the top. Right, you up. You there, you in, thank you very much, and there we go, that is the entire level complete, and we are done. Now of course this area would be level 3, but as I say, that's the end of the demo because I didn't realise I downloaded it, but as I say, link in the description below, this was really really enjoyable when I did it and as I say yeah it really got my brain working on some of them puzzles okay this time through I was able to fly because I already knew the results and how to do it I knew what the little tricks were and how things had to be done but yeah the first time going through um, a couple of them did actually stump me for a while but there we go I hope you've enjoyed this. This was Patrick's Parabox. And I'm probably looking at maybe bringing this back again at some point in the future. Once I get the full game. And I see how this does video wise. So keep an eye on this. And we will see. But in the meantime. I've been Sank84. This has been Patrick's Parabox. Thank you so much for joining me. 
look after each other. And until next time, goodbye.